Welcome to part 65 of Maryland's Pokemon Diamond Adventure. So, Team Galactic's finally been defeated and Dialga is mine. Now what? Well, first things first, let's use an escape rope to get out of uh, Mount Coronet. It's just a nice, quick, and effective way to get out of here. And, you know, I had three of them anyway, so... I certainly wouldn't want to have to walk all the way through that. Now, remember, I don't have my uh, flying type, my uh, sweet ride on me right now, so... I gotta just ride my bike back over to the PC. Oh, well. So, since the quickest spot, I think, is... Well, obviously, Heart Home right here. Let's find... Where is that Pokemon Center? Come on. There you are. Okay. Hmm. Let's see. I'm just too anxious and excited. Okay. There it is. Big old Dialga. Not too shabby. It's a pretty useful Pokemon if you want to use it on your team. Or if uh, you're playing Pearl, you'll have Palkia instead. But, um, just because I'm not going to use it on my team, just in case, you know, you're one of those types that likes to not use legendaries and stuff. So, Dialga's just going to stay in my box for a bit. But if you're having difficulty with, like, any of the fights, really, you can just train, train up Dialga and... Oh, you know what? I should really go back in and heal these guys, huh? But, uh, yeah, you can use Dialga or Palkia, your version's legendary. And it'll do really good against the next gym leader. And, um... Even against, uh, the Elite Four, particularly. Any of the upcoming fights. But, you know, then again, you're using what everyone else uses. So, I don't know if that's your style or not. Well, my style right now is to, uh... Go over to the next place. See, now that you've done everything at Mount Coronet, you can, um... You can go to, uh, the lakes here. See, like, Lake Aquity, Lake, um, uh, Valor, and Lake, uh, Verity. You can go there, and you can, um, you can catch the three, the three being things. Azelf, Yuxi, and, um, Mesprit, if you want. You can do this, actually, at any time right now, but, um, I'm not gonna bother, I don't think, right now, right at this moment. Maybe later. But just keep that in mind if you return to the lakes. I'll show that. Let's say I'll show that after uh, I get the 8th badge. Sound good? If you're having trouble, though, or, you know, you just like something strong, you can go and do that now. But I'll wait until later. Just because it's a good time to do it, you know, right before the Elite Four and whatnot. So, we need to get down to, uh, Sunny Shore City. That's our next location. Now, I don't know if you remember when we went down to Route 213, or wherever the heck that was, where there was the guy that blocked our path. You know, we, we couldn't go past him or anything, because there was a blackout in Sunny Shore. Well, now, the blackout... I think it's still there, but I think you, you can, like... No, actually, I think it isn't. I think it did fix itself. Oh, yeah, I didn't take this route, huh, did I? Well, that's a good opportunity to, uh, train Astro here. But, yeah, anyway, we need to make our way back to Route 213, you know, by the... Kind of by the lake and the stuff like that. And, and, uh, we can go and... Go to the east, now, to reach Sunny Shore. Which is where you can get your eighth and final badge. So you'll definitely want to be doing that. If you don't know where the heck you're supposed to be going right now, that is where. So, let's beat this Kranidos thing up with good old Astro, who needs some experience. A Geodude! Well, hey, can't get enough of them, right? Actually, I was supposed to fight this guy much, much earlier in the game, but... You know, I must have missed him or something. I didn't take that side of the route, so... The trainer's on this side. We're left unfought. So they're a good opportunity, like I said, for Astro to get some experience. Or any other Pokemon you're training if you're going through here. 
I recommend trying to fight as many trainers as possible so your levels end up to be a little bit higher than mine. Again, the levels of my Pokemon are pretty low in comparison, I guess, because as you see, I don't do a lot of extra training. Because everything is being recorded! <laughs> At least pretty much everything. But it's also a good example because it means, okay, well, if I can do it at this level, if you spend a little bit of time and have a higher level, well, you'll stand a better shot at it, right? Let's see what we got here. Giraffe rig. Doesn't really even look like a giraffe. Go figure. Stomp. Yeah, that didn't do too much now, did it? Okay, let's use Surf. Take this thing out. Yeah! I like having water moves again. Yay! Alright. Let's see, what do you got there, huh? East, west, or any which way. Weasel! Boo weasel! Hmm. Let's see. What to do against a boo weasel? Hidden power, of course. Bing. Fortunately. One kind of cool thing with Astro's hidden powers, it's grass type, so that's kind of helpful, I guess. Since I don't have any other grass type attacks on the team. I'll probably end up getting rid of it later on, though, but... For the time being, it's sure helpful. Boo It's super effective! Foe's Breezel fainted. Oh my goodness, he's sending in another Breezel! Can't believe it! Ooh, this is level 24 though. And it's using Swift on me! Oh my, what a Swift Breezel! Let's give it the same hidden power treatment, huh? What do you say? We Boo's Breezel fainted! And Astro gained a level! Woo! Level 35! Player defeated Collector Jamal. But they're my favorite Pokemon! Well, it's understandable. Breezel's pretty cool. Alright, so let's get going, huh? Oh, one guy left. Let's take this dude out. It's made me pretty tough. This guy's pretty tough, you hear? What do we do to people who think they're pretty tough? I don't know. I want to hear it. What do we do? We send out Astro and use Surf and stuff on them. Or we just plain crush them. Mud Bomb. Yeah! Someone set up us the bomb! what you say? I said all your base are belong to us. Sigh, that's a downer. Poor fellow! Oh well. Just move on with your life. Let's see. Just because I'm too darn curious. And too darn lazy to forget to use a max repel or something. Cricketune! Oh, uh, let's see. Uh, give it a whirl. A surf. Whatcha? Free experience, please! Not too shabby. Okay, 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 I'm so excited. Wait, where am I going? There we go. Ah! Curses. Ah! Stunky! Uh, 
Let's see how you like this, Dunk. Ow, come on! Just to make my life miserable. Oh! Just to really make my life miserable. It's like, you know, getting toxic wasn't bad enough. This I don't really care about. You've already pretty much done the worst you can do to me. To really irritate me. Take this mud bomb to the face. Ah, stupid stunkies! I'll add one more reason to the list of why I hate them so... Gah! It's a big root! Whoa, that's a big root! Alright, I'm gonna heal this guy up. And then, uh, keep on moving.